Hi, I'm Rhiannon and I'm being asked to do a vlog for <laughs> for Freshman Fridays about my experience so far at Just University. Vlog. I said vlog. <laughs> Shut up. Anyway, um, I arrived at Just University. I've got it written down, by the way. Um, on the Bishop Otter campus at one, and I um, mm. moved in with my mum and dad and my sister. Mm. And um, it was really straightforward, and some boys helped me um, move my stuff in, which was nice. Um, uh, yeah, when I went, when I got into my block, <laughs> um, some girls came and like spoke to me, who I was like sharing the kitchen with, um, and they were from quite far away. One was from Jersey, and one's from Birmingham. Birmingham. And then um, I turned around in my kitchen. There was a girl from who went to my school, but we weren't we weren't really like friends. But we've become really good friends now, which is really really good. But it's quite a shock to see her here as well. And I came and sort my stuff out. It was quite hard to say goodbye to my like mum and my dad and my sister, but I knew it wouldn't be like, too long until I see him again, so it was fine. Um, and then that night I went to the freshers' welcome party with. Um, with my flatmates and that that was a really, really good night out because we got to like meet everyone in our flat Ooh. and um meet us and um <laughs> and that was re really oh. really fun and they're really nice so people as well and we get along with it. Don't say that in my video alone. <laughs> <laughs> right, anyway. Oh. Um so I had a really good night with that and then I was all ready for my early start at nine AM which we for my theatre degree, which I got to meet everyone from the theatre course and that was oh, really, really nice. Um, hang on a uh, meeting everyone the first time was quite nerve wracking, but I kind of knew at least four people um, in my course because of like meeting them in my block and stuff. So that was quite nice. Um, and then Freshers Week was quite wild. Like there was a theme like every single night, so you kind of run out every single night. We didn't have to, but I did anyway. But Thursday night there was a show on in the showroom, um, and it was the Sleeping Trees, and I'm familiar with them because they came to my um college, and like did a performance. I can't remember what it was on now. Oh, it's really, really bad. Oh, Odyssey, Odyssey, yeah. And then when I went to see their performance Thursday, it was Mafia, and it was really, really good. It was really, really different, but it really gave me an insight to the course and what like we're doing and stuff, and they were really amazing. And um, now there is a there is a show on like every night. There is a show on every night and um, you have to go and watch as many as possible. It's pro probably quite handy that you do. Um, but I got a performance card, which I prepaid for in advance. So it's it's quite it's quite handy having one of those. Obviously, you have to pay like each time you go to the show. It's off. Um, I began to realise through the first week it, it was it, the course is in itself is quite intense. And... Um, and the degree, <laughs> stop it. Um, <laughs> the degree is quite intense. In my first narrative class, um, we got told we had like an assessment in like four weeks or whatever. So that was that was quite like hard. Um, which I only like performed like last week. So that 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 was really good. And it did go really well actually, and I really enjoyed working with the people I worked with. Um, and then in the second week we had our first voice and movement class, and. They were really, really good. And I liked it because it's quite a variety of different classes, especially with them, because I like movement and I miss, like... <laughs> oh, my God, did you just fart? <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> <laughs> Sorry, okay. Right, you two, get out. <laughs> Little rats. my <laughs> game. <laughs> oh. Anyway, yeah, so I really like that because I miss voice and movement. And... um. I like mixing with people because you get to mix with like so many different people in different classes. So that's really good. Um, oh yeah, on there's this class called Freshman Fridays, and then the, I think it was like the second lesson we had to choose our year three directing piece, and um, I we, I chose a group with domestic violence in the second. Um, yeah, so one of the year threes had to produce like a 15 to 20 minute piece on like what they like the subject they chosen and ours was based on domestic violence and the drama of murdered by my boyfriend and um, and to be honest we rehearsed Monday 6 to 8 and Thursday 6 to 8 and our director was amazing and we, we all got along so so well I was in a group with Megan, Chelsea, Erin and Chloe and um, it was just like loads of fun and actually these are the lessons of rehearsals that I enjoyed the most so I'm really going to miss that and I just had my performance last night and it went really really well. Um, 
and we respected the director, we respected Holly, oh, and yeah. as she like oh, any director. Um, yeah, so as I said, we had like our first narrative performance, and that went really well. And, and we all sort of, as a group, we got along so well and gave each other criticism. If something didn't work, then we'd tell each other, and if it did work, then it would be like great. And we worked on every scene until it was like polished, sort of thing. Um, Snapchat. <laughs> oh my god. And okay, this can sound really cringy, but I know that I've met some really good friends, apart from Charlie and Reese, because they're not pets. But apart from that, don't you dare get out. Right, apart from them two, I've met some like, and I know that I've met friends for life, so that's really, really nice. And some, I've met some really in, um, determined individuals as well in, on my course. Um, I haven't had the chance to work with everyone so far, and that's a bit of a shame, but hopefully that will change and we'll all mix up and, and be able to work with different people. Um, it's great going out. There's there's always something to do. Um, good night out on Sheiks on Thursday, but it's not so good getting up for 9 o'clock in the morning because you're hungover and you're tired. So I should probably stop that and just stick to going to karaoke or just not going out at all. But yeah. Um, yeah, I spoke about that. And like, every... could you stop farting? It's Charlie. Guy for a poo. Charlie. <laughs> Charlie. Um. Oh, a bit. Yeah, a bit about a bit about um living. Me living. Um, my my cooking is improving. I guess it's always a bonus if you can cook. Um, because I thought I was just going to live on noodles and pasta and rice and easy things to cook but um yeah so I'm quite proud of myself for trying different things and then one Sunday um a lot of my people in my halls we all had like a roast dinner and we like set the tables out in the corridors and we all like cooked individual stuff and then put it all together so that's really nice that's really cute um our halls has been known on Freshers Week um on Freshers Week mostly we our halls was known for like the loudest halls and we we're really really noisy We've already had like warnings and reset the fire alarm off on purpose at 2 a.m. in the morning. I was not very happy. And I've already used three of my lockouts, so if I lock out again, I have to pay for it. But oh well, never mind. And I've left my key at home over half term, so I've had to have like my door open like all week. Um. So yeah, it's been to be honest, it's been a really, really, really good first few months of university and I've really enjoyed it and I'm so looking forward to see what's coming and stuff and working on other pieces. Pardon? You can stop now. Yeah, all right, I'm getting there, bloody hell. Right, anyway, so thank you for watching and sorry about them too. See you later, bye!